Welcome everybody to Rare World Coins. Uh, so today, uh, what we're gonna show you is basically uh, US coins, and these are the Morgan Dollar coins, uh, 1881, 82, 83, and 84. These are all struck at the Carson City Mint. Basically, there's four mints in the US, actually, probably uh, five. Carson City, Philadelphia, New Orleans, San Francisco, and Denver. Those are the five mints in the U.S. Uh, not all of them were used in the early years. Uh, mostly Philadelphia, San Francisco, New Orleans, and Carson City. The Denver mint was only used just for one year, 1921. Uh, so if you want to view my uh, Morgan Dollars for 1921, you'll have some more information there. Uh, this one here was basically uh, Carson City, which uh, has a silver mine. And of course, they created a little small mint that produced uh, small amounts of silver dollars with the Carson City, uh, which is a CC mint mark on the coin. These are very highly collected, especially in very high grade. Uh, all four of the coins you see here are basically nice 65 or 66 grade. And so very brilliant coins. Now, we're gonna go through a few things as far as mintage. Uh, the key date right now is the 1881 CC, which has a low mintage of around 500,000 where all the other remaining three has about a million or so. These are readily available in very high grades because a lot of collectors, when uh, they were distributed, were kept pretty much in the bank vaults. And so uh, the government held these coins back and not released it to the public till later on. So there is a number uh, of nice coins available for these states, uh, but now, as collector demand increase, uh, they get very expensive at very high grade. Uh, so the first coin we're gonna look at is basically the 1891. This is the scarcer of the four coins. And these are very nice coins. Uh, so what you wanna do is wanna be sure that you have very nice detail, very clean cheek. The device is very frosty. And the field is almost like a proof-like mirror, okay? Again, it has the appearance that the face kind of sticks out from the background, giving it a mirror background. Very nice high-end coin with reflective background. And these coins are a premium if you can pick them up, exceptionally clean on the face and on the background, okay? Normally you'll see them heavily bag marked and kind of ugly. And so avoid the ugly ones because it would be extremely hard uh, to liquidate it later on. These are very popular coins. This one here is a key date. On the back, you can see the eagle, beautiful design. And if you look at the feathers here, you can even identify the feathers. And for the mint mark, you'll see down here, which will show the CC mint mark. Very nicely struck up. Uh, everything looks very nice. So that, this is a very nice appealing coin. This is something that, you know, you want to pick up and put aside uh, for your collection or uh, for your investment. Uh, if you can pick these, thing, these Carson City dollars in this condition, definitely you will have a nice investment down the road. Uh, the Carson City coins were struck between 1878 till 
1893. So it is a very short run of coins that were struck at the Carson City Mint because the rest of the coins go from 1878 till 1904 and then 1921. So this one only went up to 1893. So, and of course there are a lot of key dates in between that if you found them in this condition, like the 93, the 79, then we're talking about between 20 to $100,000 in very high grade. Beautiful coin, very good coin to add to your collection. And we look at the 92. This one here is considered, is graded by NNC. And this one here has, it says DMPL, which means deep mirror proof like. So the field is highly polished. It is a mirror field. And so you should be able to see your reflection on the field versus a frosted one. So this one here is a very nice coin uh, as far as condition. The face is exceptionally clean. And so this one here is a high grade MS 66. Normally, uh, and, and C is not a, rel a reliable grader, but like I said, always buy the coin, not the capsule that it's in. So be sure you are looking at the coin and then have an idea what the grade of the coin will be. But this one is exceptionally nice, nice device. Device means the lady's head. Uh, the fields are a deep mirror field. So, but it has a very light toning on the reverse. Very nice coin with full breast feathers. Oh, man. You know, so it's very nice in the condition it's in, you know. So you want to get these coins as close as possible and as this great as possible for these coins. And of course, since this is being a deep mirror proof like, this is what you want to buy. Uh, uh, the value of deep mirror proof light has a premium over the regular uncirculated coin. So this one would be worth more than the standard. Next one here is an 1883 CC. Now this is all frosty. The fields are frosty. The face are frosty. This is a basic business strike, but it is a high grade MS 66. Beautiful coin. Exceptionally nice. Very nice appeal. On the reverse, also very nice. And you can see the CC uh, in, uh, Carson City mint mark down at uh, dollar between the D and the O, full breast feathers. Yes, beautiful coin, a gorgeous coin for your collection. Last, we have uh, an 1884 CC, also very nice. This one here is DMPL, deep mirror proof like. You can see the mirror field on the coin, very high grade 65. This is the uh, this is what uh, uh, the coin you want to get. This is a premium quality coin with deep mirror fields, and so these coins will go from a regular uncirculated of 500, but when it has deep mirror fields, then we're talking 15 to 2,000 dollars easily on these coins. On the reverse, see how that sticks out, is the eagle that sticks out from the field. Nice mirror field, beautiful design with the CC. This is a true deep mirror proof like. 
So this is the ultimate collector's coin, okay? Uh, the proof-like mirror field makes it very, very pretty. And the reflection of the field, the eagle just pops right out of the coin. Gorgeous piece. And like I said, if you could pick these coins up in this condition, definitely you will have a very nice collection. Very nice, beautiful coin. Hopefully these four coins uh, with the Carson City will, you know, at least assist you as far as if you want to collect Morgan dollars uh, from uh, what the Carson City Mint. A lot of these coins are scarce to rare. And of course, if you can pick them up in deep mirror proof like, that's a plus. Avoid coins that have too many bag marks, too many distraction on the face, um, too much too many ugly tonings. Uh, be sure you get premium coins if you're gonna go as an investor. But if you're starting as a collector, and get a few basic uh, coins to start off with. Uh, they're not gonna be expensive. Normally a nice BU would run you about $100 or $150. But when you get into the high grade 63 to 65 to 66, then we're moving into 1500 to $2,000 per coin. And if it's a deep mirror proof like, then we could be talking about, you know, 2000 to $5,000 depending on the date. And if it's the rare coins, uh, 1879 or 1893, then we're looking at 50,000 to $100,000 price tag. Hopefully the information will help you out. As far as you want to get into the series of the Carson City, it does get pricey. Uh, but uh, picking up a few uh, samples is probably a, a good thing to add to your portfolio. Be sure you get a very high grade if you can. Uh, if you're just starting out, just get yourself a nice sample BU. And at least you have a, at least one year of the CC dollar in your portfolio. Hopefully this information uh, will help you out. And the images also uh, will show you what you need to uh, at least pick out and uh, I should have more videos to show you in the near future. Have a great day.